hi guys and welcome to another video today i have a small little collective random haul um i would definitely say more than half of this is definitely pink and girly but i still think it's all good stuff um so i am just gonna go ahead and hop on in um the first thing i'll show off is this toothpaste i saw that it was on alta and i missed it so I ordered this off of the Moon website. I am so excited to try this. It's just some pink toothpaste. It is bubble mint flavored, which I thought was interesting, but it's also whitening. So I am excited to try this. And when I opened this um, in the mail, Sadie got so excited. <laughs> so I know she's also going to want to try this with me, but yeah i did see that the toothbrush came back in stock but i don't know but yeah that is that i'm i got stuff all over the place next i know this is like boring and random but i bought three reusable bags and i just thought they were really cute these were all 99 cents at home goods so we got a really cute beachy vacation one, little Polaroid cameras and everything. This one is my favorite. I instantly thought of, obviously, I mean, filming YouTube and I love baking. So I thought that this one was adorable. And then the other one is some really cute happy faces or smiley faces. So... I loved all of those and I can't go wrong with having reusable bags I feel like. Um, I ordered a top, sorry, off of VC, I'm pretty sure that's how you pronounce it, but it's just a really pretty, I'm gonna say like hot pink top and it's just roughly, this was actually on sale, um, but I love these kind of tops and I love the pink color. so love it cannot wait to wear this as well this ended up being i think like 20 dollars instead of like 40 um around there but i thought that was super cute um from ulta i picked up a couple of nail polishes for sadie um i gave her the other three i bought four just to kind of get free shipping and everything i if i know that i can spend money or if i have to spend money to get shipping i'm not paying for shipping i will just buy items instead because you gotta spend that money anyways so i picked up these like 100 disney ones this one i am saving for christmas um so she hasn't seen this one yet um but the other ones that i ordered was um frozen so olaf um elsa and anna so that is those and then also i picked up the tree hut new scrubs of course i grabbed the coffee one and i loved this cute little set this is the coffee body scrub and then the heavy cream or sweet cream um shea butter so I'm so excited to try this and I just, I love the packaging. I was going to, of course, buy both together anyways. So I like the fact that they came up with this because that's just an instant buy in my opinion. And then I saw that they released the new Ariana Grande Cloud Pink. And Maddie, if I'm not mistaken, loves the original Cloud. So I did pick up both to try them. Um, so this one I kind of have had like a scent of, I'm, cause I'm pretty sure, like I said, this is the one that Maddie likes. Um, she'll probably correct me next time I see her if that's not the case. So there is that one and it, my oven is preheating. So that's what that noise is if you heard it. <laughs> And then we have the beautiful pink cloud, which I think this is so pretty. Oh my goodness. So I cannot wait to wear these. 
All right, I then made a purchase. This was a little while back. I made another purchase on Victoria's Secret Pink um, when they were finishing up their semi-annual sale when they had things still super, super cheap. I ended up getting this like track outfit. I'm starting to get into the matching outfits. And it's so funny because this is stuff that my grandma would put me in in like middle school or not middle school, maybe elementary school. So I got these like creamy, like beige or tan um, sweatpants. These were originally $56 and I paid probably 10 for them. Um, so I, I had to get them. I just cannot pass that up. Fall will be here before you know it. Um, but just this pink on the side. And then same with this one. I got the hoodie or the zip up jacket. The same color. Might wear them together, might wear them separate, doesn't matter. But I mean, again, for the price, this was literally like 10 or $12 and originally again, $60. So couldn't really resist that. I also got another piece from um, For Love and Lemons. This was actually on sale and I ended up using or they were running a promotion. So this was like, for the brand and the retail price of this, this was like a no brainer for how like cheap this ended up being. It was unreal. Cause this is originally like $120 and it came almost to like, probably down to like 70. Um, so not bad, but this was a new release. This was like a seashell one so pretty the little pearl in the middle and then like the little shells and starfish on the cup just really really pretty and there's also a bow that wraps around your waist and it's just so pretty even the ribbon is like printed so this was absolutely gorgeous and wasn't a need, but ended up in the cart anyways. Last two things were these. These were like three or four dollars a piece. I don't know what these originally run. I've never tried the Coco Peach, nor have I tried um, a body scrub from them, but these have really great ratings online and I figured for the three or four dollars that they were, why not give them a go? So yeah. Next is Team U. Kept things in packages a little bit so they wouldn't get like super ruined so that's why you'll hear all the crinkling but i got a flower bear i really wanted one of these and i just thought they were cute but i loved this one because it had a little tool like princess crown on it so i got that i loved it i picked up this um like glittery puff I didn't know how this worked and I'm just like okay but it's just a cute little puff but it's like infused with glitter so and clearly I don't have anything on you just literally pat this I don't know if you look at how beautiful and sparkly like yes just have a little poof ball but this reminds me of um a puff ball that like my mama has but i didn't want to spend the price tag of hers because hers, hers is a stay water and it's not something i would like actually wear every day so this will do at least for now <laughs> um the other couple things a pack of butterfly hair clips okay they need something to say hi okay hang on let me get these unwrapped really quick okay so i opened like a couple of other things i'm a little sad because this butterfly clip is like the iridescent one and it's broke so that kind of stinks um 
but I mean, I guess you could still, no, you can't use that. That is sharp. But uh, yeah, so that is broken. But the other two turned out good. But like the glue, like up close, they they don't look great in like presentation. Like you can see like the hot glue like stringing off of this. And I mean, you can clearly, well, maybe not on camera because of my lighting, but you can kind of see This one's so pretty. I really wanted this one. Um, so I mean, from afar, they won't look bad, but definitely up close, you can, you can kind of see. So I don't know how I feel about those, but I mean, they were inexpensive. Same with this. This is a um, AirPod case, but it's not like functioning like I thought it would, but I thought it was so cute. Um, but it looks very dirty and dingy. So it's supposed to be a cute little like perfume bottle and it says like cocoa on it. Comes with a gold chain, which just literally fell out and it's, you know, tangled. But I don't know if you guys can tell, it looks very like cloudy and used in there. Like yellow. Hopefully you guys can see that and I'm not just making a face for <laughs> no reason. But I mean, I thought it was really cute, but this definitely looks like it's been like used. So I don't know, this is like the first time I've really had an issue ordering things from there. So I'm a little disappointed, but I don't know, it's okay. Um, can't be too mad when things are like inexpensive um but I do have this really cute pair of earrings to show you guys which I was very happy about again perfume bottle like I think these are really adorable and I'll insert like a picture up close on what they look like too but I thought these were really really cute and then the last thing is a mascara. I was kind of hesitant to try this, but it had some good reviews. But also this packaging, holy crap. Um, this is stunning. Like, look at that. Although this, uh, this looks like a weapon. Um, so little, little, little worrisome. I didn't open this. Ugh. So I don't know what the wand looks like or anything. I feel like I'm going to rip this packaging and like all these diamonds are going to come off. Hopefully that's not the case, but. Let's see if it's like tacky or anything. Hmm. So, I mean, I'll try it. <laughs> He's on the living room with Sadie. But, yeah. Interesting. Interesting try. So, that is that. And then, I think the last thing is I bought a cup. And I bought a really pretty pink cup. Look how pretty! Oh my goodness. I saw this and I had to have it. Um, it was expensive. Uh, $22.95. But, oh, it was so pretty. I, I love that it was like base pink but iridescent. Oh, I'm, I love it. I, it had to come home with me as well. And this is why Target always costs me money and why Target is such a store that I should not be shopping in. But anywho, that is it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, I know I have one or two other videos planned and then I'm going to try and throw my little travel vlogs in there just because they're not going to be like super fantastic or anything. But if anybody wanted to see them, 
um you know they'll be just pretty much like a bonus video but that is it i'm going to clean up my mess get ready for my dinner um and enjoy the rest of my night but i hope you guys enjoyed and i will see you guys later bye guys